Hello dear lovely students, this is me again. Today we have a new subject. Uh, this is the last subject of chapter 5. It is section 7, dilation, page 212. So dilation is easily is used to make the objects larger or smaller. But what is important in this section is mostly we have that graph and we have to find we have 1, 2, 3 and 4 coordinates. We have to find the missing coordinate that is, for example, here we have D. How to find it? First, because they are similar, then they are proportional. 2 divided by 4 is equal. Then 3 divided by D. We can simplify 2 with 4. Okay, 2 divided by 2 is 1, two div 4 divided by 2 is 2. After that, we can do the cross product. D times 1 is D. 2 times 3 is 6. So right now, students, let's say, got confused how to write, let's say, is it 0, 6 or 6, 0? It's quite easy. When you find the result, directly focus on the, let's say, D with the, 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 the number beside, because it's on x-axis, it's 3, 0. Then D must be 6, 0. This one's the correct one. It's not correct. Okay, next question. Again, we have to find D. 6 divided by 15 is equal 10 divided by D. Simplify divided by 3 is 2, divided by 3 is 5. So, do the cross product. Uh, D times uh, 2 is 2D. 5 times 10 is 15. Divided by 2, divided by 2, so D is equal 25. Is it 25, 0, or 0, 0 25? Because B is 10 and 0, it means it is 25 and 0. Example 3, this time we have negative numbers. Again, it's easy. 4 divided by 10 is equal S divided by negative 20. As always, because we have simplifying here, then 4 divided by 2 is 2, 10 divided by 2 is 5. Then do the cross product. 5 times S, 5s is equal 2 times negative 20 negative 40 divided by 5 divided by 5 so s is equal 14 divided by 5 is equal 8 but there is a negative okay is it negative 8 0 or 0 negative 8 because we have 0 negative 20 then s is 0 negative 8 0 negative Eight. Okay. Then we have some Nishtimani questions here. Which coordinate for C makes C O V similar to A O B? Okay. So we have four divided by C, or you can start with the with at any side. It's okay because they are proportional. We get the same result. Negative six divided by negative 10 is equal c is not given divided by 4 divided by 4 so we can simplify 6 over 6 uh, over 10 6 divided by uh, 2 is 3 divided by 2 is 5 negative divided by negative is positive then we do the cross product 5 times C is 5C. 4 times, uh, 4 times 3, I think we have made a mistake. Let me resolve the, the question. It is negative 6 divided by negative 10 is equal C divided by 4. Okay? Then we have to simplify divided by 2 is 3, divided by 2 is 5, negative divided by negative is positive. 
So 5C is equal, uh, 3 times uh, 4 is 12. Divided by 5, divided by 5. So C is equal 12 divided by 5. So 12 divided by 5, if you want to do it step by step, 12 divided by 5 is 2, 2 times is 10, then it's going to be 2, so 2.4, 2 2.4. Okay, is it 0 and 2.4 or 2.4 and 0? Look at here, it is 0, 4, that's why 0, 2.4, A is the correct answer. A is the correct answer. Then question three, it says given that uh, the triangle AOV similar to X, O, Y, find the coordinate of X. So the coordinate of X is here. Okay, even the graph is not quite clear. It's X and here negative nine and zero. This one is zero and negative three. Zero and negative eight. So let's solve it. It is negative nine divided by x is equal negative three divided by eight. Negative eight. Between three and eight, we cannot simplify, so we do the cross product. Three times negative uh, x times ne negative three, negative three x. Negative times negative is equal positive. 9 times uh, 8 is equal 72. Okay, so we have uh, divided by negative 3, divided by negative 3. So negative 3 and negative 3 cancels, so x is, is equal 72 divided by 72 divided by 3 is equal 24 but with negative so here negative 4 and uh, negative 24 and 0 it is the correct answer okay so again with that section we have two two branches two two let's say subjects sometimes the teachers are not let's say paying attention about it but it's they are important first one is distance between two points. If you have, let's say, two points, how can you find the distance between that two points? So the rule is x1 minus x2 power 2 plus y1 minus y2 power 2, then we have square root. Okay, we have this question here. The question is, we have negative 1 and 3, 4 and 5, it says find the distance between these two points. x1 y1, x2, y2. Okay, then let's find the solution. x1 minus x2. x1 is negative 1 minus x2 is 4 power 2 plus y1 is 3 minus y2 is 5 then power 2. Negative 1 minus 5 is going to be negative 5 power 2. Plus 3 minus 5 is negative 2 power 2. Negative 5 power 2 is 25. Plus negative 2 power 2 is going to be 4. 25 plus 4 is going to be 29. And it's going to be 5 point something. It's approximately... 5.38. So this is the way you find the distance between two points. The other subject that we have, it is finding the, um, the midpoint, the middle of two points. If you have x1 and y1, x2 and y2, how to find the, let's say, midpoint, x1 plus x2 divided by 2, y1 plus y2 divided by 2. For example, here it says find the midpoint of these two points. First one, 2, 4, and 6, and 6. Okay, so it is x1, y1, x2, y2. 
Okay, x1 plus x2, it means 2 plus 6 <coughs> divided by 2. y1 plus y2, 4 plus 6 divided by 2. 2 plus 6, 8. 2 plus 6, it's 8 divided by 2. 4 plus 6, it's 10 divided by 2. 8 divided by 2 is 4. 10 divided by 2 is 5. So the midpoint of these two points is 4 and 5. Even if you have negative numbers, it's the same. x1, y1, x2, y2. x1 plus x2 divided by 2. Negative 2 plus 4 divided by 2. Okay. y1 plus y2. 4 plus negative 3 divided by 2. Negative 2 plus 4 is 2 divided by 2. 4 plus negative 3 is 4 plus negative 3 is 1 divided by 2. 2 divided by 2 is 1. 1 divided by 2 is 0 0.5. So the midpoint is 1 and 0 0.5. Question, this is the, the Nishmani question. It says, what is the midpoint of 4 and negative 5, 2 and 1? So x1, y1, x2, y2. x1 plus x2, 4 plus 2, divided by 2. y1 plus y2, minus negative 5 plus 1, divided by 2. 4 plus 2 is 6, divided by 2. Negative 5 plus 1 is negative 4 divided by 2. 6 divided by 2, 3. Negative 4 divided by 2 is negative 2. So 3 and negative 2 is the correct answer. So A is the correct answer. So dear lovely students, this is the end of this, uh, let's say, chapter 5. I hope you get benefit from me. Thanks for watching.